And in the wake of the Orlando nightclub massacre, police here in Chicago are stepping up patrols ahead of Pride Fest this coming weekend. CBS 2's Mike Puccinelli is live in Lakeview where the fest will take place. Good morning, Mike. Good morning. Of course, Pride Fest kicks off this weekend, followed the next weekend by, of course, the Pride Parade. But in the wake of the Orlando massacre, both celebrations will be marked by a security presence unlike anything ever seen in the 47-year history of the Chicago Pride Fest. The Chicago Police Department isn't putting any numbers out right now, but CPD leaders say they have already dramatically stepped up the police presence in targeted areas of the city. Additional police resources will be deployed in the 19th District, which includes Lakeview, Lincoln Park, and Boys Town. While police say they have no knowledge of a threat against the LGBT community, they are ramping up security out of an abundance of caution. That, as leaders in the community, vow not to let fear be their guide going forward. I think it's important that we not live in fear. Um, if we live in fear, those who want to create harm to us have won. Um, I also believe that it's important that we support one another and we keep our eyes open, um, but that the center remain a safe place for all and not a boarded up place that needs someone to buzz you in. And you're looking live at the center on Halstead, where the doors will remain open, Valle says, in defiance of hate mongers. Also in the auditorium tonight, there will be a vigil to commemorate the lives lost in Orlando. There will be armed security guards on hand for that event, but Valle says that is normal for big events at the center. Finally, Mayor Emanuel released a statement saying, in part, we will not be intimidated by those who use fear and violence to attack our fundamental values. He also said that he looks forward to marching in the Pride Parade in about two weeks. Reporting live at Waveland and Halstead, Mike Puccinelli, CBS2 News. Lionel, Aaron, back to you. Okay, Mike, thank you.